Hi, I'm Dr. Erica Ward. I'm an elephant vet, and I'm here at Elephants World in Thailand. I'm here with Gaina, Tommy, and Boon Rung, and their Mahout, Johnny, Happy, and Klahan. Elephants are very famous for their trunk. It's very strong. They use it for many things like eating, blowing on themselves. They suck up water and cool themselves down. They drink water with it. They rip their food with it. Many, many things. It's full of hundreds of thousands of muscles. And they have two big nostrils, just like we do, but they go all the way up to the top. Asian elephants have one finger on the tip of their trunk, just like we have a finger, and a palm on the bottom, like this. African elephant trunks look a lot different. They have one finger on the top and one finger on the bottom. Elephants have these great big ears, and they're kind of shaped like the, like the country India. And the elephants have such big ears to help cool their bodies down. So elephants don't have any sweat glands on them. Instead, they use water that they get from the ground or they spit into their trunk and they'll blow it on themselves and that helps cool, us, cool them down just like when we sweat. They have a lot of blood vessels that run on the back and on the front of their ear, especially on the back. And when it gets really hot, the blood will flow through their ears and then flapping them back and forth helps them cool down. Elephants have very big leg bones, both in their front legs and their back legs. And their whole body is designed kind of like a table. So it looks a lot different than some of the other animals we're used to seeing, like dogs and cats and, and horses. Their legs have, their bottom of their feet have a fat cushion in the back right here. So they have all their toe bones and then a big fat cushion in the back here. And as they step down, their foot expands and all of the weight gets spread across. And then when they lift their foot up, it acts like a pogo stick and actually helps propel them forward. It's pretty cool. And the acoustic fat that's found in their feet, they can also hear a lot of vibrations. They can hear vibrations both in their feet and with their very big ears, they can hear sounds from very far away, just like a, a big funnel to help get the sound into their eardrum. And now here we get to see Tammy's tail. She has very, very thick hair on the bottom of her tail. And as you can see, she's waving it back and forth. She does that to help keep the flies off of her body. It acts as a really big fly swatter. Elephants have kind of small eyes for their body size, and their eyesight isn't very good either. They can see some distance in front of them, but they can't see anything right in front of them like this, anything right behind them, and anything too far back like this. Elephants are pregnant for longer than any other mammal. Usually they're pregnant for 18 to 22 months. That's a very long time. Elephants eat for many, many hours of the day and night. They only sleep for about four hours and they spend most of the rest of their time grazing for food. They love to eat grasses and corn stalks and all sorts of barks and trees and roots. They usually will knock down a whole tree just to eat the fruit, knock down another one just to eat the bark. So they can be really destructive in the forest, but they also help rejuvenate the forest. Their favorite snacks here at Elephant's World are bananas, watermelon, pumpkin, sometimes pineapple, and many different fruits that you and I enjoy too. Here at Elephant's World, they care for many old elephants that have a really hard time chewing their food. They require special diet and special veterinary care. If you ever want to come and see them, it's a great opportunity.